everybody it is nico v here with another installment of partner in a year the series where i vlog every week on my uh, journey to trying to get the title of twitch partner within the span of one year quite a hard goal but i figure i do this because it's uh, something for me to do it's like a it's consistent content i guess in a way and uh it's just something i can look back on when this is all over if i get it if i don't <clears throat> So uh, yeah, let's start uh, with the weekly recap. What did I stream this week? First off, uh, before we get into the streaming thing, I will say that I did make a video, a Back for Blood video that did pretty well. Uh, well, you know, uh, relative to me, got like 300 something views, which, you know, for me right now with this channel is uh, a good amount. So maybe I'll make more Back for Blood content. Um, I actually do plan on making more Back for Blood content in the future, so that's great. Thank you, everybody, who checked that out. Um, and then we're going to move on to Twitch and what I did on Twitch. So Monday was... Monday, I didn't really have much to do, so Monday I just did Minecraft. I wanted to continue building uh, building a, building a the hotel for my followers and building a, a restaurant for them now, and I'll probably continue that tomorrow uh, just so I could finish the project because there's some days where like i feel like there's some weeks where like i'll do something in minecraft and then i won't come back to it for a while and minecraft streams are always like pretty chill so um yeah we'll see though because again i've been doing playing a lot of back for blood and i, I want to play more of it so maybe i'll just stream back for blood and there's a new twitch extension in back for blood so um maybe i should try that out we'll have to see uh okay so Monday, Minecraft, not much going on there. Just kind of something, uh, a place for followers and I to hang out. Uh, a nice chill stream, if you will. Tuesday, I played the original Fallout, which was actually a very fun game. It's very different from Fallout 3 because the first Fallout game that I played was Fallout 3 and then New Vegas. As of right now, New Vegas is my favorite Fallout, but... uh. I went back to my roots and played Fallout 1, and that game is drastically different. It is a hardcore RPG. Lots of dice rolling. It feels like you're playing D&D, &D, and it's actually pretty cool because I don't think I've ever played as hardcore of, like, an RPG experience as Fallout 1, and I'm having a really good time with it. And this whole week, I've just been wanting to play it, but I've decided that it's going to be a stream game, so I got to wait for streams to play it. Uh, and I'm trying not to stream outside of the schedule. And then even then, outside of the schedule, I've been playing a lot of Back for Blood anyway, so I don't have much time for it. But I am going to be getting back into that next week. Um, There was a guy that came into the chat and said he was a dev of the game. Now, whether that's true or not uh, has yet to be seen. I don't know why a dev would stop by like with a, ran a random like five-viewer streamer and just say what's up. But if that is a dev, that's pretty cool, right? I guess that's something I can uh mark off my buckets list but i'm holding my breath i don't think it actually was but if it was uh that would be cool um then we move forward in the week and then friday we finished resident evil 5 with patrick fun game great game i saw chris redfield punch a boulder top tier quality uh video gaming uh the peak of the resident evil series uh might i add uh it was a lot of fun just hanging out getting to finish that game um, cause it's a good game. Resident Evil 5 is, is cool. It doesn't, it's not, wasn't much horror to it, to be completely honest, but it's, it's fine. It's still a fun experience, you know? Uh, it's kind of the same with Resident Evil 4, where Resident Evil 4 didn't have much, uh, didn't have much to it in the way of horror, but it's still just a great game through and through, um, in my opinion. And, uh, yeah, that, so that was, that's pretty much it for the week. It was kind of, it was a pretty slow week this week. Didn't get very many. Well, that's not true. I got a couple. Uh, got a couple extra followers from. I think it was because of the Back for Blood video. Because you know, sometimes you don't go on Twitch and your follower count just goes up, and it's like I assume it's related to what happened with Back for Blood. So that was pretty cool. And uh, I guess right now I don't really know what else I'm gonna talk about because I again kind of a slow week this week, so not really much to say. I will say though that um, I received another another payment this week from twitch another twitch payout so that was cool and it was also the biggest twitch payout i've had and it's i was kind of surprised because i knew that i had like a good amount of subscribers um because of all the support that i get from the people that uh do watch the stream like uh, again like panda and sc the two people that they're hard caring right now is the word that i would use to describe them 
Um, but yeah, the, like, I knew that my subscriber count was, like, going up because of all the gift subs they were giving. Um, and some of the gift subs that some of my other friends were giving, which, again, like, I, I can't believe that's happening. I'm more than, like, I'm extremely grateful for it, like, considering how small of a following I have. And, uh, Twitch Payout came out, and it was a pretty... It wasn't like, you know, I'm not, like, a top 50 streamer here making a million dollars, but at the same time, it was the biggest Twitch Payout I ever got. So, again, I gotta, I gotta give a shout-out to those guys and thank them so much. I do that... If you've been following the series, I do it pretty much every week, but I just, I have to. I gotta mention it, because it's, like, it's it's insane, you know? Um, and then uh, we're moving on in the uh, month of November, and at the end of November is actually my birthday. My birthday is on the 26th, and I am planning to do a special stream, a special birthday stream. Um, hopefully I can get some people in there, because I think it will be a fun day, and obviously... I want to, I don't know, for my birthday, I want to hang out with the chat, you know, and hang out with people that have so far been uh, willing to hang out with me and watch me struggle through this whole debacle, you know. Um, and yeah, oh, and then uh, we also got a new emote. It was an emote called, uh, it's the cheese emote. It's literally just a wheel of cheese because in my Discord, there have been a few people that made a, they requested, and I made it for them, they made a channel called The Cheese Cult, and they just like to talk about cheese and send pictures of cheese, which is cool, you know, cheese is pretty good. Um, I'm not sure if it's the healthiest thing in the world, but, you know, I I would be lying if I said I was not a big fan of cheese, so, a uh, new emote, because the the follower emote thing, like, there there's now follower emotes, so you can get emotes if you're just a follower of the channel, which I, th I think is good, you know, I think that it's, it's good to reward reward people for just following rather than having to subscribe i think that definitely helps the small uh the small communities a lot more like mine because then people have something to to look forward to uh if they follow your stream i do however i do however think that i need to get a few more made it's just the cheese one for now but i'm gonna look to expand on that and yeah that's pretty much it before we go i'm gonna say right now also there's rumors that Halo 5's multiplayer, or sorry, not Halo 5, oh god, not Halo 5, no, 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 please, not Halo 5 again. Uh, Halo 5, or Halo Infinite's multiplayer is going to be releasing tomorrow, and my thoughts on that, personally, I, I don't want that to happen at all, because I planned for it to be on December 8th, and like, that's why I started, I started some new games, and I want to finish the games that I'm currently playing right now before we get into December, and... Halo Infinite comes out, so, uh, yeah, uh, please don't come out tomorrow, Halo Infinite, I'm begging you, we'll see how poorly this ages tomorrow, uh, if it, if it does come out, because I, I don't think it's a good move, I think you just wait for December 8th, because, like, that's when a lot of people, I've seen some people on Twitter that, like, that's when I've requested time off for work, that's when I was, like, planning to play it, so it coming out tomorrow would really just throw a wrench into things and that would also happen for me too because obviously i have all these games that i really want to stream and play like back for blood and fallout and i don't need to throw infinite into the mix because when i play that game like i'm, I'm never it's never going to stop it will never stop um so yeah so i'm just i'm just hoping that they have the presence of mind at 343 to just like let's just we'll let we'll let let the call of duty and battlefield hype die down a little bit let those players kind of chill get their fill december 8 rolls around that's when we'll go full force with halo infinite that's what i'm hoping for but we'll see i'm just uh, i'm just a consumer i'm not the guy that makes the decision so um personally i want i would uh, please come out december 8th that's all i'm asking um I, it's so funny because when the when the beta hit i was i was begging for it to release early because i thought that like it was a really well-made game and i was having so much fun with it however now let's i think it would be fine to let it cook a little longer because i'm a little busy right now um that's gonna be it though for this week's episode i don't have like much else to say again kind of a slow week didn't do much but i did get a fat twitch payout so thank you everyone that has been supporting me thank you everyone that's even stopping by the streams and like i know that i shout out the people that gift a ton of subs but like even the people that just come by to watch uh thank you to you guys as well um you guys are kind of, y'all are making this stream possible as we move forward. So thank you guys so much. Uh, this has been, oh God, what is it? Episode 15 already? 15, geez, we're almost there. Um, we're almost halfway there. Uh, time flies, huh? Uh, episode 15 or 16, I don't even know. I'm, I'm lost. Uh, it's been, it's the, the weekly Twitch video. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Nico V.